In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up the Insta360 ONE X so it's ready to record your first video and I'll also show you some best practices that you should follow. How to insert the micro SD card. To insert the micro SD card, have the ONE X LED screen face you and have the micro SD card gold stripes face you too. Slot it into the ONE X and gently push it in with the tip of your fingernail and you'll hear a click when the micro SD card is secure. I recommend you get the SanDisk Extreme Pro V30 micro SD card. How to insert the battery. To insert the ONE X battery, have the ONE X LED screen face you. Open the battery door by lifting the latch up and pulling away. The plastic tug of the battery should be on the right hand side. Insert the battery into the ONE X and close the door. You'll hear a click when the door is secure. How to safely charge the ONE X. Place the ONE X into the pouch to keep it safe. Plug in the charging cable into the ONE X. Plug in the other end of the cable into a USB plug. Put the plug into a socket and switch it on. And the ONE X will begin to charge. The red light indicates the ONE X is charging. When the ONE X is fully charged, the light will turn off automatically. How to format the micro SD card. The first time you put a micro SD card into the ONE X, you need to format it. To do this, turn on the ONE X, navigate to settings, cycle through to more settings, scroll down to format, Tap the big button to confirm and tap the big button again. The ONE X is now formatting the micro SD card and it is now complete. How to attach the invisible selfie stick. Screw the selfie stick into the bottom of the ONE X and to make sure the ONE X is properly secure, hold the tip of the selfie stick and the ONE X and twist it in opposite directions. Your ONE X is now properly secured on the invisible selfie stick. ONE X best practices. Never touch the front or back lens with your fingertips because the fingerprints on your lenses will reduce the video quality. Never put the lens down on a hard surface. You will scratch the lens. To clean the lenses safely, I highly recommend using a microfiber cloth to gently remove dust. The front of the ONE X is the side with the LED screen and this is really important when filming because the front of the ONE X should face the subject of your video. For example, if I'm filming a video of myself walking, then the front of the ONE X should be facing me because I am the subject of the video and this guarantees no stitch lines where the audience will be looking in the video. How to update the Insta360 ONE X? To update the Insta360 ONE X, First, make sure the battery is 100% full. Download the latest firmware from Insta360's website. Go to Downloads, Insta360 ONE X, Camera Firmware, and Download. Connect the ONE X to your computer using the charging cable. Turn the ONE X on. Your computer will now show the Insta360 ONE X directory. Copy the file you just downloaded from Insta360 and paste it into the root directory of the ONE X. Safely eject the ONE X from the computer. Pull out the cable. Turn on the ONE X and it will begin updating automatically. When it is finished updating, it will restart by itself and then your ONE X will be updated with the latest firmware. Download the ONE X app. The ONE X app will allow you to set manual exposure, see a live preview of the video you are recording, and turn your raw footage into edited shots. Head over to the App Store on your Android or iOS device, search for Insta360 ONE X, and download the app. Connect the ONE X to the app. To connect your ONE X to the app, turn the ONE X on and navigate to Settings. Cycle to Wi-Fi settings. Make sure Wi-Fi is set to on. 
scroll down to Wi-Fi password and press the big button to view it. Now go to your phone Wi-Fi settings and tap on the One X Wi-Fi hotspot. It may take some time to show up. Enter the password shown on the One X and tap connect. Open the One X app and now your phone is connected to the One X. Download Insta360 Studio 2019. Studio for One X is Insta360's desktop stitching and editing software to get the best quality possible out of the One X. You can also create over capture videos really easily for Facebook, YouTube and Instagram. To get the latest version, visit the downloads page of the Insta360 One X. Right click the file you just downloaded and click run as administrator. Click OK for the English language. Click next. Click yes. Click next. If you have Premiere Pro then you have an option to install the One X Premiere Pro plugin. This plugin will allow you to import INSV files directly into Premiere Pro and automatically stitch your 360 video. INSV files are the raw video files from the One X. So when you record 5.7K video, the One X creates two INSV files, one for the front lens and one for the back lens. So make sure not to delete any of these INSV files or rename them. Keep this box checked to install the plugin. Click next and complete the installation. If you get this message, click agree and install. And if it fails, don't worry, it will still work. Studio for One X is now installed. Download the One X slot. To color grade your One X footage in a video editor, you will need the One X slot. This will add color and contrast to your video. You can download the latest One X slot from Insta360's website. That's it for this video. You now have everything set up for your One X. And in the next video, I'm going to show you how to navigate the One X internal menu system and show you all the different options you can set.